basic movements of Tai Chi, Chuan and exercise. Open, close and up, down movement exercise. Begin in standing position with both legs spreading out and putting both arms to form an arch in front of the chest. The spaces between the thumbs and four fingers of both hands should be drawn close to each other to form an embracing circle with the elbows slightly lower than the wrist and the shoulders. When bending the legs and the center of gravity goes down, both arms should stretch out and draw back in open closed movements. When both legs stand straight and the center of gravity goes up, both arms should stretch out in order to balance the body. and counterclockwise movement exercise. Begin in standing position with legs half bent. Then rest two hands on the waist with palms down. Move both hands clockwise while body leans forward and counterclockwise while body bends forward. movement exercise. In standing position with legs half bent, then put two arms in parallel position in front of the chest and make rubbing movements from right to left with palms facing outward. Alternate continuous palm turning movement exercise. Both hands making continuous palm turning movements in front of the body with the upper hand not higher than the mouth and the lower hand not higher than the stomach. In making left palm turning movements, both palms should be facing left and in making right palm turning movements, both palms should be facing right. This exercise may be carried out in original stationary location or in step moving location.
forward rubbing step movement exercise. Make a complete bending of the right leg with the body supported by the raising of the tips of toes. Then use the side of the heel to touch the floor gently and make rubbing step movements towards the left. Meanwhile, with the left foot on the floor, the center of gravity shifts slowly to the left foot. Backward rubbing step movement exercise. One of the legs bends completely to the floor. The other leg stretches gently backward, touching the floor with the tips of the toes. Then gently makes an arch movement and returns to the original position. Both exercises may be carried out by shifting from left and right legs alternately.